Hey everybody, I just thought I would do a quick little update. Please excuse the lighting, but it's kind of, you can probably see from the window of a, yeah, there. <laughs> That's kind of hard to do. Um, it's quite dark at the moment. Um, obviously it is post Christmas, but I still have my Christmas tree and the lights up and the like bunting and all that jazz. Um, and you'll probably notice that I look slightly different to last time. Like my hair's like nowhere near as long as it used to be. So I've had my hair cut. And it's also a different colour. I dyed it pink because, well, you know, why not? I thought I'd go for something a little bit different for sort of the Christmassy New Year period because I've been feeling a bit pants recently and I thought I'd cheer myself up. So I have pink hair, which is the first time in... Ooh, how long has it been since I last had pink hair? A very long time. It's got to be about five years maybe since I've had pink hair. So, um, yeah, the pink hair is back. And I quite like it. I kind of look like Frenchie out of Greece which is kind of cool because she's my favourite character because I'm sad and I really like musicals. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I just wanted to do a quick little video to say I hope everybody had an awesome Christmas. Um, for those of you that don't know, I'm not the biggest Christmas fan, despite the fact that this is... Hang on, there we are. This is one of two trees. I have another one in my bedroom. But the reason I went a bit nuts this year is because it's mine and my boyfriend's first Christmas sort of living together. So we thought we'd make an effort. Um, but I do struggle with my mental health around this time of year. And therefore, I'm not usually sort of all over the place going mad about Christmas. But it's actually been really good this year. Um, my partner and I spent Christmas with my family. And we're actually going to see my partner's family this evening for New Year's. Um, so we're travelling to Cardiff. And I'm praying that it doesn't, like, snow on the way there. It can snow once we're there. That's fine. I would quite like to see some snow, but not on the way, please. Because we have to go across the massive bridge. And I would really rather it wasn't snowing whilst we did that. Because I don't like bridges. But, um, yeah. So I hope everybody had a happy Christmas. I had a really good Christmas with my family. It was lovely to see them. I got some really cool gifts from my boyfriend. One of which I'm wearing. These are one of my presents from my partner, Lyndon. They're little love heart earrings, which I love. And he also is totally amazing because he got me ruby slippers and Glinda's wand earrings from The Wizard of Oz because I am obsessed with The Wizard of Oz, among many other things that were also awesome. Um, <laughs> they did really well, so I got thoroughly spoiled, which is always nice. But um, yeah, I just wanted to say hello. I wanted to wish you all a very happy new year, which is coming up very soon. I will be going to see um, Lyndon's family. Um, spending it in Cardiff so that'll be nice and just like wishing everyone a really happy and more importantly a healthy new year as many of you know my health has been an absolute nightmare this year um, I'm still struggling with my problems with my neck and my shoulder I've got slipped discs and cervical spondylosis which basically means I can't drive and I'm off work which is really annoying um, and have been for some time and I'm bored out of my head now um, but <laughs> yeah it's uh, I'm hoping that 2018 will bring me better luck with my health I have a consultant appointment on the 19th of January so hopefully I will get some kind of plan from that which would be great it would be lovely to know what's going on and yeah I just hope everybody else has a great celebration and I will see you all in the new year thanks for watching and thanks for subscribing and I will see you soon bye